Hi there guys, this is Nikhil from Greedy Tech and in this video, I am going to show you how to detect if your Windows files are corrupted or not. So by that I mean the files related to the operating system. So just in case if your Windows is running very slow and you feel that the explorer is very laggy, let me just show you. So this is the explorer when I open it up. So all the drives are visible in just a fraction of a second. And just in case when you do that or when you open the my computer, if it takes at least 30 to 50 seconds to load up all the drives, then it simply means that your system files might be corrupted. I'm not saying that definitely your files might be corrupted. In some cases it is probably because of slow hard drive. So anyway, just in case if you want to check if your windows files are corrupted or not, all you need to do is simply open the command prompt in admin mode. So on Windows 8 and Windows 8.1, to open command prompt in admin mode, all you need to do is simply press Windows X. So when you do that, you get a menu from the bottom left corner of the screen. And from here, you need to select this option that says command prompt admin. So once you do that, a command prompt will be opened in admin mode. So just in case, if you are on Windows 7, simply press start button and type CMD. So this might not be the exact thing that would look on a Windows 7 PC. But when you search for CMD, you will get this option that says command prompt. Simply right click on it and select the option that says run as administrator. So finally, once you do that, you will get this prompt. And in this prompt, you need to enter a command that is sfc space slash scan now. So once you do that, it will simply perform a verification check, checking if the files are corrupted or not. And at the end of the scan, it will give you a result that is if your files are corrupted or not. If the files are corrupted and if the corruption level is very low, then it will try to repair those corrupted files. And if it cannot repair the files, it will just give you an error message. So let me just show you how the message looks like. So guys, this is the message that you might get. So Windows Resource Protection found corrupt files but was unable to fix some of them. Details are included in so and so. And there are means to repair or fix these corrupted files but I personally find it a tedious job so I simply reformat or reinstall windows once again to fix this problem so if you don't have any corrupted files it will just give you a scan completed successfully no corrupted files found so in this way you can know if your windows files are corrupted or not so that's it guys thanks for watching this video I hope you found this video to be helpful please subscribe to my channel to see more videos just like this